words can be very slippery tools. Those who misuse them look like fools, but power brokers can contort clear messages to serve their sport. Our own King Cole was a pleasant fellow. He liked good food and was always mellow. Our kingdom could perspire, prosper with this good man. But the merchants of fear Ooh. have a different plan. In comes I, King Cole the Fun. Yay! If you want the party, I'm the one. Yay! Music and dancing, food and drink. It's a good thing I don't have to think. <laughs> Enjoy the heck out of life. Yay! That's my motto. Seeking pleasure, avoiding strife. I wear my motto every day to remind me to go out and play. Yay! In comes I, Queen Anne the Wise. Oh! I face the world with open eyes. A fool's a fine philosophy and it works for him because of me. He'd dive too deep into life's pleasure, but moderation is my treasure, and healthy living is my goal. I won't let poisons reach my call. I visit farms that grow our food. I know their crops are safe and good. Some lettuce grown by Farmer Price with homemade dressing. It's quite nice. Some help, some dinners based on good spring greens will help you fit into your jeans. Um. Not tonight. We have a guest. <laughs> he rules the kingdom to our west. King Rex is both powerful and wealthy. We can't feed him something healthy. <laughs> I hear your favorite meal is caviar and milk-fed veal. For protein, yes, but don't reject those greens so fast, may I inspect? <laughs> My team of crop geneticists each day develops some new twist oh. to modify the DNA of every plant that comes their way. Last week, we dined on chocolate kale. <laughs> I'll have them send some in the mail. <clears throat> My high-tech food requires no farmers. Good riddance. Those guys are alarmers. They talk about manure and dirt as if they eat it for dessert. <laughs> Only on special occasions. That's right. My prime objective for our farms is that they all do good, not harm. No pesticides, free ranging stock, organic grain for the chicken flock. And all the workers they engage, they must be paid a living wage. our modern meals. Do more with less. More money, less good. Your wife's obsessive about food. Down to business. It's getting late. I need you to cooperate to stop, stop the alien invasion that is a threat to both our nations. Aliens? You mean small people? Bulging heads? Big dark eyes? And right in our midst, what a surprise. <laughs> Will they zap us with their ray guns? Or cause a rash of strange abductions? <laughs> a rash? My border patrol <laughs> protects our lands. <laughs> they work a hundred mile wide band. I shouldn't boast, but just today they put five aliens away. Your borders here are open wide. Just anyone can come inside. Woo. Welcome. True, he got in. 
But worse is yet to come. I'm home of fatherland security. The king and queen rely on me to keep them safe from terrorists. Tourists? Safe from tourists? Tourists! Safe from tourists. Listen, are you deaf? Tur, er, is. They're all around us, right in our midst. Sire, now my budget is far too small. Well, you're lucky I'm here at all. We need some planes, some trucks, and uh, drones. Oh! To find conspirators in their homes. People in inconvenient. Uh, uh, in I got it. Give me a minute. <laughs> Dramatic pause is all. Inconvenient places. People with suspicious faces. <laughs> Give me a dozen arm. What? Our people should be left in peace, not bullied by their own police. <laughs> Give me a dozen armed patrollers to search each out drunks, panhandlers, and strollers. <laughs> Treaty. You've read. You gotta hold it right side, huh? The Treaty. Treaty. See? Treaty. Here. I'm sure to keep both borders more secure, whatever Rex does, you must do. And that's planes and bombs and cameras too. Oh boy. <laughs> now look, this makes no sense at all. You know our land is much too small. Our borders can't be a hundred miles wide. We're less than that from center to side. Everyone hates border. Our people should be left alone, not followed by a flock of drones? Who knows what all those spies may find? <laughs> well, if they're not guilty, why should they mind? <laughs> don't you want to protect our nation? Well, no matter, actually. It's a treaty obligation. Whistle? Wrong hand. <laughs> the border, you see. Well, I try to remember my next line. This is the dramatic pause part. My factories will supply our troops, excuse me, patrols. No, you can't me. I'm not here. Supply. You would prefer to step aside. Which I would surely understand. I'll take the kingdom into my hands. <laughs> no thanks, we'll stay and try to manage to undo your dreadful damage. We'll see about that. The Border Patrol is on the loose, encircling our kingdom like a noose. Drones soar above the roofs and houses while agents move <laughs> among the people. Because I'm a drone operator. <laughs> a drone operator. <laughs> coast to coast, Fort Drum to Tijuana. I'm no coward, I'm just a soldier. I'm a drone operator. <laughs> I see an angry demonstration. 
administration. It's clearly threatening to our nation. Those folks looked armed and dangerous. I hope that they don't notice us. <laughs> oh, wait. We have some chatter from the hard. I can't make out a single word. <laughs> we want to pick your rhubarb. Rhubarb. Shoo, 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 shoo. I hate rhubarb anyway. <laughs> I'm going to have a happy meal today. <laughs> Quick, while the queen is looking the other way. Nutrition. <laughs> Can someone help with this condition? I am a biodynamicist. <laughs> a sort of gardener, astrologer, physicist. I can't cure itch or stitch or gout. But still, you cannot live without the knowledge that I bring today to help the king and save the day. Yay! Yeah. Yay! <coughs> my, my skills and almost magical talents will help bring the world back into balance. <laughs> it's melting now. As you must know, the, the <coughs> living plants begin to grow. So give his body now to me. The, his formal change is spirit free. Yes. With our help, the king will rise and fly freely into the skies. The urban farmer here and I, we will help him. So he died. <laughs> Once the king has lain in state, I'll take him to a better fate. I have the perfect burial plot. Oh, <laughs> Is it, yes, a burial plot after the king has lain in state. A burial plot. The warmest compost pile I've got. <laughs> <laughs> the corner of my parking lot. <laughs> So that because in time, because in time the, the king will be, will be returned, returned to, to earth through peas and beans, a part of you, a part of me. He'll feed the workers he displaced, and the nutrients he consumed replaced. The king is people. The king is people. King Cole should be so proud that he inspires a royal compost recipe. <laughs> oh, the composition won't be too hard. Now some fine wine, some saffron, hold the lard. Uh, I yes. think I'll add some ambergris. It's too pricey for folks like you and me, but what the heck? A king deserves some fancy things in his preserves. Yeah. Special effects, cool. That's <laughs> <laughs> science. Yeah. Can I? No. I just can't believe that no one understands. They tell us to fear people from foreign lands, but we're more endangered by foods that we eat from the pesticides present in corn and in wheat. Now that is a threat that should be better known. Even a queen cannot fight that alone. So I must seek allies throughout the land, like farmers and workers. We'll walk hand in hand and together we'll grow crops in our local fields. 
and bring you the nourishing food that it yields. But we must join as one to enable that dream. So how can we do that? The Rock Party! Happy made it. 